Sir, may I now request Chairman Isro and Secretary, Department of Space, Sri S. Somnath, to deliver the welcome address. Honorable Prime Minister of India, Sri Narendra Modi ji, Honorable Governor of Kerala, Sri Arif Mohammad Hanji, Most Respected Chief Minister of Kerala, Sri Pinarayi Vijayanji, Most Respected Minister of State for Government of India, Sri V. Murali Tharanji, All the invited guests, industry captains, representatives of space startups, all my dear colleagues from ISRO in Space, NSIL and Department of Space, my heartiest welcome to Vikram Sarabhai Space Center ISRO, which is the birthplace of rockets and the mother center of the space technology. This is a golden letter day for the entire ISRO, having our Prime Minister in our midst being an ISRO center and uh, facilities to take a review of the progress of Gaganyan for VSS. It's also a historic event, the very first ever visit of our Pro Honorable Prime Minister to this center after <laughs> almost 40 years. The significance when PM is dedicating to the nation three of the important major projects of ISRO, which was approved a few years back and completed on time and cost, but for the, some difficulties that we faced during the COVID times, the PSL integration facility, the semi integration testing facility, the trisonic wind tunnel, mark significant additions to the infrastructure of ISRO, which will help in enhancing the launches, support new developments for the entire space sector. We have seen tremendous progress and accomplished by ISRO in the last 10 years in terms of the missions accomplished, programs launched, and also the uh, Chandrayaan-3 and Aditya L1 that made the world look India with great respect. With the vision and support of our Honorable Prime Minister, the space sector is going through rapid transformation for expansion, unlocking the space sector, the new space policy of 2023, the FDI policy, enabling the regulating the NGs in all domains of space activities through in space. The long-term space vision for the Amritkal has already been announced by our Honorable Prime Minister. The vision is created for accomplishing the Vikasit Bharat with space sector as a torch bearer. The vision, in addition to rapid expansion of space economy to have scientific accomplishments such as long-term human space missions, building Bharati and the Station, continued exploration of moon and other planets, and also to have an Indian on the moon by 2040. We in ISRO wish to assure you, sir, that we will do our best in bringing the best in our technological, industrial, entrepreneurial, and academic capabilities in India to achieve the leadership in space domain and make Bharat achieve its status during its journey to Vegas as the nation. Let me take this opportunity to heart, heartily welcome all our Honorable Prime Minister once again to Vikram Sarabhi Space Center and thank him for the time spent here. I also wish to fondly welcome our Honorable Governor of Kerala, Sri Arif Mohammad Khanji. I heartily welcome the most respected Chief Minister of Kerala, Sri Pinarayi Vijayanji. I heartily welcome the most respected Minister of State, Sri Vimurali Tharanji. I also welcome all of you, distinguished invitees and my dear colleagues to witness the historic occasion and to listen to the words of our dear Prime Minister. Thank you. Jai Hind. Thank you. Thank you, sir.